What's up everybody, it's Small Chiba Rufi, and today I'm going to be talking about Dead Battle Prediction between Haichi versus Geese. <sighs> Tekken versus King of Fighters. Now, long story short, it was enough noise and I'm happy to have peace. Like before, it was like street races, so it was just disturbing. Um, so, long story short... <laughs> Me, I love King of Fighters, I love Tekken, I love Street Fighter, those are three of my favorite games of all time, and they have the best rifles on Sakura Kazugano, Yuri, Ibuki, and Athena. So, with that being that, let's continue on. Now, <laughs> this is that battle. I'm going to be comparing it to the Jin and Ryu fight, I'm going to be comparing it to other characters, and overall, use what... That battle has spoken in the past and try to fix it all in, you know. I remember, let's start with this. Um, I remember back then they were saying in the Ryu versus Jin fight, they were trying to compare Haichi, um, something like Haichi fought like uh, Akuma and due to those two fighting, they like Akuma has shown to overbeat. Haichi, I believe they said, like be more stronger and capable of doing that stuff. Well, when Jin was fighting Haichi, it was, they were like the same level or something like that. But Akuma fought, like successfully beats uh, Haichi more. So that that means, um, oh, uh, due to Akuma being Haichi and Akuma being known to fight with Ryu a lot of times and then the, the end of the story in Street Fighter, Ryu beats Akuma, so it goes like, Ryu beats Akuma, Akuma beats Haichi, and Haichi and Jin, you know, they kind of have their thing of um, back and forth, but I believe Jin, correct me if I'm wrong, Jin beats Haichi at some point, but also they were trying to compare the demon forms and then the demon forms of Haichi and Akuma, I believe they compared on one of those card things back in that dead battle. And then they were saying like, um, uh, this one of the forms within the attack in the anime is not, it's confirmed to be non-canon by the creator. Now with all that, now you all know what I'm, my mindset and thinking about his side is. So... So taking all that in one thing, right? Because we know that battle likes to go back and reference their other death battles. Say, oh, in this death battle, we have analyzed that this character has done this feat. And that's made 10,000 gigatons of TNT or whatever the fuck they say. You know what I mean? So this is a, just an example of what I'm trying to say. So I think they're going to bring up that feat. So talking about all that in general, I think, you know... Aichi is going to be, you know, he's he already has the um, Jin related feet like I talked about. So, yeah, they're going to do that. And I remember, yeah, they're going to talk about all that and compare it to him, like Jin and him. And I think I would be surprised. And you know what? They will also be talking about Oscar from Tekken because that's, you know, it's a cousin of Jin and the same family line. All three of them are like family, right? And, um, moving on from that, let's get a little bit on King of Fighters, because I don't want to leave them like that. Now, King of Fighters side, I could see, because, uh, Terry Bolgard versus, uh, Ken Masters from Street Fighter. I remember in that, that battle, because like I said, they like to bring in the little cards and reference other dead battles, so I think it's, um, fair to say for me to do it as well, right? So, in that dead battle, they talked about, you know, Ken versus, uh, I just said it, Terry Bulgar, oh like I just said it, Terry. Um, so, long story short, if you did not know, Terry won against Ken, and he used like that feet of psh, and then it's like electricity whoosh, and to get him like that and the floor hitting hard and going up against him. And that's a pretty powerful attack, especially for someone who's going up against Ryu a lot of times. And I already said Ryu to Akuma. Akuma, they said in that battle in the past of Aichi. We know that. Now, comparing Ken and Terry's that battle and seeing what he's capable of, Terry, Terry is in King of Fighters. So Terry's attack, you know, being that powerful attack going against Geese as well. Now, I'm not 
Remember when about the old games of Tekken or King of Fighters, so correct me if I'm wrong. I do not know if they have fought Geese and... Yeah, I think they did fight at one point Geese and Terry. And, um... Uh, what was it? Uh, of course, Jin fights. I, you know, Haichi over here. But, um, what was it? Yeah, uh, you know what? I could say this. You know, because, of course, in fighting games, you know, they'd be fighting. Of course, he's not immune to Terry's attacks. You know, he actually gets hurt. It's not like, oh, I could take your attack. Ha, 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 I got you. And then, block. You know what I mean? Like, he actually gets affected and all that. But he's capable of, you know, how, what was it? Um, Overcoming all those injuries and fighting as well. So, what I can say is this, long story short. So, keeping it on the this fighting. And before I end the video, I want to keep going in this mindset of dead battle, fun games, fun game characters in dead battle, because I think that will be really interesting. So if you're interested, stay tuned for that. So let's talk about it. Doorbell defeat. Who do I think will win? We are voicing because he fights evil Ryu at some point. Haichi. I remember in Tekken 7, I believe the intro. Yeah, the intro, I believe they were fighting each other, and then that's like one of the first uh, fighting things, like in the beginning. And it was a pretty cool fight. You know, he has shown to be capable of many things. Like, I remember at one point, like in the past, they have said like, uh, oh, this one character in Tekken has defeated a meteor, meteor coming to Earth and stuff like that in the Jin fight, I believe they said. So... Seeing that, comparing that feat with, you know, Jin and Aichi, um, I think uh, that's a pretty big feat, you know. So comparing, this is my mindset, what is more stronger? Someone who could take an attack from someone who has dealt with a meteor feat or someone who has electricity and who could stun the bodies of someone. And like uh, Terry Bogard did to Ken Mastels in their dead battle. And we've seen how that affected them. And I remember that was one of the big reasons he won his dead battle. So, you know, that's, it's like, will they say the meteor feat is more effective than that? Or will that be more effective than a meteor due to it? Con, you know, all that fiery electricity connecting to the human body and uh, causing so much destruction. You know what I mean? So, yeah, <laughs> I, I'm not sure. But, hmm, I don't know. Because, I'm, correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't, I didn't think they, because we all know, you know, we, you can, they go at it fighting and training against each other, right? So, I, I don't think they compared him 100% to Ryu, Ken, and their death battle. So, Terry, I could see him being a good, you know, like, Balance, like balance, as in like comp comparing. They're gonna be comparing Terry's, you know, feats or something like that, uh, to Geese's, and due to him being a King of Fighters character and being able to co beat a lot of those characters as well, and all of that, I could see him kind of having a little bit of the durability feat, to be honest. Um, especially when they what my memory of the other death battles and what they said in the past. So, because a lot of times, you know, even though that battle is not 100% accurate. Okay, let's just, let me just say that right now. You know, there's a lot of times they got these uh, power skills wrong and all of that. And I must say, but a lot of times they do enjoy to use their f well, misinformation to try to do this without... And in my opinion, that in general is kind of lazy. I would like, uh, because a lot of times they've um, kind of underestimated characters. Like Tifa Lockhart is a perfect example of this. Just go look at that, how that was that battle of all time ended up. But moving on from that, I think overall, you know, seeing how what these characters are capable of, seeing what they said in the past and comparing them to other fun game characters due to trying to justify a specific number of either their strength or their ability strength, you know, numbers. And I would say, to be honest, like, don't get me wrong, I love both of them. Like I said, Street Fighter, Tekken, King of Fighters, three of my fa favorite fighting games of all time. So I'm not trying to be biased. When it comes to durability, because, oh, also, what's more stronger, 
Jin's demon form, which he fought against, or Terry's whoosh, electricity, which he uh, went up against. You know what? That's a great fight. You know, I would love to see that. Terry versus Jin. <laughs> yeah, that would be pretty fucking cool. But I'd rather see, you know, I'll talk about all that stuff next, I mean, uh, afterwards. But overall, who do I think is going to win? <laughs> Ooh, I don't know, it's kind of tough. I, I truly do enjoy the boat, but I would say this. When it comes to, I'm breaking it down in groups, so I don't try to, because I don't want to be biased, I don't want to feel like I'm being biased. You know, I truly do love them. Similar, like maybe even equally, right? So I would say this. When it comes to durability, who would win? I truly think, because the electricity versus a demon, you know, Jin's demon form, and then I'm going to compare him. They compared him, what was it, to, I mean, a Jin to him, and then him to um, Akuma. And he lost to Akuma, I believe, yeah. And then, you know, Akuma's form is stronger than the Jin form, so... I would say, when it comes to durability-wise, mm, maybe, maybe, hey, yeah, okay, I'll go with Tekken for durability, but when it comes to strength, I'm giving it to you, okay, I'm giving it to King of Fighters over here, the, the, the strength, and everything else, ah, mmm, who do I think will win, <laughs> ah, this is crazy, okay, if they're going to truly uh, go for um, overall power-wise, right? Comparing all the characters, I truly think, because I don't think King of Fighters has a feat of y y galaxy, boulders, all that stuff. I might be wrong. I might have forgotten a few things in the past King of Fighters game. Though ability-wise, and all those crazy capable of, I'll go for K Tekken, Okay. 100% that goes for Tekken. But when it comes to characters that's able to um, have crazy amount of powers and feats, that is like, for example, oh, sorry. So the ability, Tekken. And I'll say the power wise. Yeah, mm, yeah, probably. I think I have to go with Geese over here for that other one. So overall, who do I think will win? Mm, I don't, I'm not sure. To be honest, like, I kind of want to say, I kind of don't want to pick, but I truly want to just talk about this fight because I was like, oh, finally, there was a great fighting game, that battle, and I love fighting games, and these are two of my favorites next to Street Fighter, like all three of them, like, like I said, close to my heart. <sighs> Overall, who do I think will win? Let me just say this, I, I think Tekken has a chance. Now, I think, you know, King of Fighters has a huge chance, but Tekken will win on this one, okay? I'm going to say that. Tekken will win, but it's not a huge difference. It's very close, in a way, okay? Because that you, that Meteor feat versus what Terry's capable of, and that's not even counting the other characters. Like, oh, look, if you want me to really go into deep, okay, like... And like, I'm going to be saying these death battles. Like, okay, let me just talk about the death battles I want to happen. Okay, and this is going to be my my way of saying, if I'm going to compare this character this, to this character, you know how much I love them, and you know how much I think they are capable of strength, durability-wise, and all that, okay? Now, I think, like I said, uh, maybe a uh, free-fall... Uh, or something like that between Sakura Kazugana from Street Fighter, Yori from King of Fighters, and Oscar from Tekken, or maybe a 1v1 between Yori and Oscar, or Sakura, Oscar, Sakura, Yori, maybe put some Videl from Dragon Ball versus Sakura. Why? Because a lot of people still talking about that Galaxia and Beerus fight, like, just move on already, but moving off of that. Um, overall, I love this fight, and the other death battles that I would like to happen, I'm just going to say a few of them relating to these two is, like I said, you know, Sakura Gazagana from Street Fighter vs. Yoi, or Asuka, or Asuka vs. Yoi, Sakura vs. Videl, you know, I think these will be pretty interesting fights, so I hope those, any of those fights happen soon, and maybe in the next season or this season, I would love it for this season, uh, just like, uh, at least give us, you know, for the Street Fighter one, just give us Oscar versus Yori. I mean, 
um, Sakura versus Yuri, at least, you know. I, I would love that. that. That would be perfect. I would truly do love that one. And then, you know, you got Yuffie from Final Fantasy versus Ibuki from Street Fighter. And then, oh, I could talk about fighting games and Final Fantasy all day long. <laughs> With that being that, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Tell me who you think will win. Tell me who has the better though ability feeds. Uh, Terry Bogard's um, attack is stronger than Jin's demon form. What do you think about that? Do you think he uh, Geese is capable of um, going up against Haichi and though ability wise and uh, can take more punishment due to Terry's attack? Or do you think Jin's demon form is, uh, you know, has shown um, that, uh, what was it? Haichi is capable of tackling that and going up against that so i think uh you know it could be a true debate between this one <laughs> like i said i love both of them and uh, i told you all how i feel who has what the ability and strength so overall you know what i don't want to just leave it like that but let me just say this um uh this this is one of the best step battle ideas of all time okay and I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You all know who I'm going for. So, with that being that, tell me who you going for on this one. Tekken or King of Fighters. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, bye.